Hi all, I hope you are well. Today I will show you a comparison of all four sizes of the butterfly. I received them literally three or four days ago. So today, together with my nephew, we will do a quick unboxing now and we will show you a comparison between all four of them. We will show you all the sizes next to each other so that you can see how they look like. So stay tuned and let's start. Okay, let's take a little bit closer. So let's look at the packaging first. Uh, I can say that all of them look almost the same. When you look at the cover, um, at the main cover of the box, I have a feeling that this picture is less vibrant than these three. It's the same as with regards to Wales jigsaw puzzle. It doesn't have got this um, slickness to it, and the color is definitely less vibrant there, with this one. I'm not quite sure whether you will be able to see the difference, but this one is less vibrant. So I'm not quite sure whether it will be the same case when we do them. Uh, but we will see. It's worth mentioning that the medium size was bought last year and all the remaining sizes, so small, king size and royal size, were bought a couple of days ago. If you have seen my video compare, uh, that where I compared this one, Chameleon, that was bought last year and Wales, which I bought a couple of days ago, um, there was a difference with regards to size of the jigsaw puzzles and the way the uh, the picture looks like. So I'm really curious to see whether it will be the same case with remaining three, but we will see. So let's compare the boxes first and whether all the information is the same. Okay, right off the bat, I also can say that this box opens all the time, so it's quite difficult to keep it closed. But let's start from this angle. So you can see that the royal size doesn't have information about some information about the website, Instagram and email address, but maybe it will be somewhere different. Again, another difference with the royal size, you don't have a barcode, which is on all the remaining ones. Whoops. Then here, the difference, have we, have we got any difference? Let me have a look. We have got information about number of pieces. And again, on this one, oh no, one second. Yes, on this one, you have got information how big it is on the right hand side. On all the remaining ones you have got on the left hand side. And on the right, you have got information, just, just the um, sentence, intergalaxy butterfly. And here, Again, a tiny difference when it comes to the packaging. So right off the bat, I can say that this packaging of the Royal size is definitely different to all the remaining ones. What tells me that because this Royal size was introduced later and the same as Wales shape was introduced later, it may be that they have got different supplier or manufacturer who does this for them because it seems that this one looks more like the whales than the previous batch of the jigsaw puzzles that they introduced at the very beginning when they um, started their their business but i may be wrong we'll see later and then on the back of the packaging uh, let me see quickly i can see it looks basically the same with this one it looks it looks the same and let's do this one let's be careful okay it looks slightly different there is like a different information here um, there is more here but it's still I would say roughly roughly the same almost the same so yeah definitely differences when it comes to the royal size to all the remaining 
um, puzzles so far. So now let's do the unboxing and let's see what's inside. Ooh, something new in here. interesting this is definitely something new okay so what i can tell you from the get-go is that all four of them have got as usual information that you have just seen which which was also in this one and you also have got the logo uh, however, the royal size have got the this um, more like I don't know. It's like a mirror, mirror one. So this is the 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 main difference. And now I can also see there is something in here. It's not here, and it's not here. Okay, interesting. All right. So another thing that I can already say right off the bat is that. At the very beginning, when they introduced these jigsaw puzzles, Butterfly and I think Fox had a dedicated mounting system. And I can see that there is the mounting system for the king size, which is this one as well. But it's not here and it's not here. So I'm not quite sure whether this is kind of the different batch, the, the first batch they had. And now they are introducing something different because you can buy a um, separate mounting system on their website. I'm not kind of sure what the was the reason for it. Okay, so now let's have a look into, let's open all of them and let's have a look into the sizes of these jigsaw puzzles. Oh, wow. Okay. I would like to focus on the sizes of these jigsaw puzzles because, again, when I was comparing the butterfly M size uh, with the chameleon M size and the whales, I've noticed a slightly difference in sizes of the uh, of the pieces. But what I can say about these is that I feel that they are roughly the same. Uh, I wouldn't say that one of them is smaller than the other maybe the um the small size of the butterfly is slightly smaller than the other ones but right now as i look into them as the first impression i feel that they are roughly the same yeah i would say they are roughly the same let's then take um these i just grab random uh random pieces this is the m size so the one that i bought last year this is the new one this is um king size and yeah let's grab it this is this okay and again they seem to be uh they seem to be the same all right, so these are the first impressions. So just to summarize, the box of the royal size is slightly different than all the remaining ones. These three boxes are the same, of course, apart of the size, because the bigger the size, the bigger the box. The, the medium size and the king size have got dedicated mounting system, which I'm not quite sure why, because the small size and the royal size don't have dedicated ones. So as I said, probably these are from the previous batches and these are the newer batches uh, that were introduced or just the new ones. They sold out the previous ones and in order to have the mounting system, you need to buy it extra on their website. And now we will start creating these jigsaw puzzles and when they are done, we will compare them next to each other and we will show you the difference in sizes and in the feel and how they look and in the colors and everything with regards to that. So see you soon and stay tuned for the final thoughts. Okay, so this is where we are with the butterflies and or four sizes. I will show you them now to you quickly and then I will change the paper to a four 
and show you whether they really are equivalent of what they say. I will say that this is a European paper size, not American. I just want to let you know because from what I know in the United States the sizes of papers are slightly different. Okay, so first things first, let's talk about the size. So as you can see, the small size and the medium size are a little bit bigger than A5 and A4. And they are, when, when it comes to its size, it is, I would say, comparable and like for like, I mean this one is smaller, this one is medium, but you can see that this is kind of the same amount of pieces coming out from both of them. So they both are slightly bigger than A5 and A4. When then we go to the king size, the um, situation is slightly different and you can see that it is within the a3 equivalent of A3 size, so that will tell you right off the bat that this size is actually smaller when you look into the way these two look on the equivalent of the paper size. And then when we go to the royal size, um, I I had took different approach with this one when I was doing the jigsaw puzzle, which I will cover in a second, but this uh, cardboard is equivalent of A3. Um, I will show you on a B-roll in a second that I had that checked. So again, you can see that that size corresponds with the way that the small one and the medium one are. So it will be coming out a little bit beyond the A3 equivalent of the paper size. Let me maybe rearrange it slightly so that it looks um, more like small one and the medium one. So give me one second. Okay, I, I rearrange it slightly. Okay, I rearrange it slightly. So you can see that um, after rearranging it a little bit, it comes out a little bit beyond the A3 size, but it's still not as much as the small size and the medium size. As you can see here. So that's the first thing. So when it comes to sizes, there is a little bit of inconsistency. Um, when you want to, when you are comparing them to the equivalent of the paper size. So A5, A5, A4, A3 and A2. The biggest inconsistency is with the royal size, then it's a bit less with the king size and the most similar are the small size and the medium size. So this is the first thing. The second thing that is actually quite of a difference is the color, a color payoff and the way they look. So there is consistency across all these three. However, the royal size looks significantly different. And what I mean by that? The first thing is that the, the stars are much wider. Let me do a close up for you here. So these are much more bright all the stars here which is lovely this is a nice feature here and you won't have the same here and you won't have the same here because they are basically the same but these are just smaller or bigger and the other difference is which which you may have already noticed right now the color so these three first three have got very vibrant and 
and are very colorful and they are very navy blue with uh, with different types of navy blue tones and undertones i will be showing you this because uh, between this and this one because as i said these three are the same when it comes to the color but the royal the royal size is different so the color these are definitely more navy blue these uh, this one leans more towards purple especially here in this section in these sections here the edge is more uh, purple than navy blue as well as this part here is definitely more purple than it is navy blue i will also put one of this these butterflies on top of this one so then you will see the difference i also want to mention that i'm recording it in the artificial light because the days have been so gloomy and gray that the doing it in the natural light didn't really show you much of what i wanted to show you so this is when it comes to the color the third thing is with regards to the um, the layer and what I mean by that. So again, these uh, first three have got some sort of laminate on top of it. However, this one doesn't have it. And I feel that this is one of the reasons why the color of this one is slightly different than this one. Oh, there is one more difference here. You have got some sort of like a light blue teal type of feature and and detail whereas here it's just more of a blue and on the other three it's more like light teal so this is another kind of difference in the design so so when it comes to the design of this one well the shape or the color not the shape the color this one is definitely slightly different than the remaining three so if you would like to buy, let's say, all four of them in order to display them on the wall, like one under the other or one below the other, this one will not look the same as, as these three. So what I was talking about, so the 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 um, so there, on, on these three, there is some sort of laminate that makes it look more shiny. And this one is without it. And it in feel, it makes it a little bit more kind of raw like there is no layer and it, you also also will notice that when you scratch it it is slightly different so this one doesn't have got this laminate and then this one has and you may say and you may think that it may be because this is the royal size, so maybe they weren't able to do that. Well, I can't I can't agree with that because I also um, have already put a comparison between the new whales uh, shape and I and uh, which is in M size, and I compare it with the butterfly and chameleon, which are also the M size, and the um, this this top of the whales is the same as the royal size so it is without the laminate and the colors of the whale are not as vibrant as these three butterflies are when it comes to the difficulty i would say and what the what the uni dragon says on the website i would say that definitely this one is the most difficult and one of the reasons well the uni dragon doesn't really say it on the website but what they do they have got um uh, the suggestion of how much it will potentially tell, take you to do these jigsaw puzzles and I would say they are actually quite accurate with these. This one was definitely the most difficult and I took different approach with this one which I will show you on a b-roll. So what I did, I basically started dividing the, uh, the pieces um, according to the color and what I thought comes together and um, I was doing different sections of it of course i started with the edge which i was suggested to do otherwise you may struggle with doing the middle parts which i was also doing anyway um i was doing it with my mom and it took it took it took us around 10 hours to complete so it was definitely a challenge one of the reasons that this one is challenging is because some of the shapes are very um, how to say it undefined what i mean by that is that these shapes are very like curved uh, maybe i will be able to show you one 
here, for example, some of these shapes are very curved and it's much easier when the shapes have got the flower or when they've got a star because it's easier to find potential another piece. So this one is definitely challenging to do and I would suggest you to do it like in, in chunks or with breaks. Otherwise, it may be a little bit too exhausting, but it was still a good fun. I will now do a close-ups for you um, of the way how they look on the uh, the bright sides and then I will turn them around. I will also try to turn around the biggest one but it definitely will be a struggle and the reason why it will be a struggle is because they are extremely fragile so if you just touch them in a, uh, a little bit too much or you move them a little bit too much uh, they will kind of break and you will have to do them again so be careful with that because even moving them from one piece of paper to another um broke some of the pieces i mean not broke but i had to i had to do them again so be be um mindful that these are very fragile and if you decide to buy the bigger size and make sure that you do the jigsaw puzzle on the surface that you really want to do this puzzle and then um, in a surface that it will make it easier for you to move it if you want so you have to have very um strong edge of the table or whatever you are doing it because if you have got any curves or anything like that it may be difficult also it was quite difficult and I mean, difficult but a little bit challenging to put a paper underneath that because the surface underneath is not that smooth so sometimes it took me a bit of time to really put it underneath the paper because I was doing my jigsaw puzzles on this sofa so just bear that in mind and really if you want to do them make sure you do them on a on a surface that you want to do them I will put these close-ups at the end and I will put a video um, not the video I will put a music under so that you can have a look and enjoy oh see you can see here that because this paper is a little bit up it's already kind of damaging the jigsaw puzzle and it 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 breaks very very easily so i will do all these close-ups and i will then turn them around and show you how they look um on the other side i like doing it because one of the things that i enjoyed when i was comparing whale chameleon and the butterfly was the fact that when you turn them around you can see that there is a shape within a shape so there is butterfly within the butterfly there is chameleon within the chameleon and there is a whale within a whale and in these shapes there is always a uni dragon logo so this is very nice detail which i actually quite enjoy and appreciate so i also want to see whether it is similar whether it is different when you look into these four sizes of the butterfly so i will put that at the at the end one last thing that i want to say is with regards to the sizes of the um of the pieces so i would say that um definitely the smallest pieces that i had to um, deal with with regards to uni dragon puzzles in general were in the smallest butterfly and in the medium size of whales other than that i would say that these three are fairly the same of course the sizes are bigger smaller these are very quite chunky and quite big and and others are very very small so there is a lot of variety when it comes to uh, sizes of the pieces but overall i would say that um, there is some sort of consistency if you will my final thoughts when it comes to these uh, puzzles is that especially when it comes to the royal size um i would say that in my mind uni dragon could be more transparent with customers because this doesn't look the same as these three and the, the what you see on the website which i have just checked is you see this you see this example of the jigsaw puzzle and 
this I'm, I'm not sure whether you really see it um, on camera and you will be able to see it on the video but this is not the same it is really not the same um, let me put the this butterfly or the medium one next to this one so that I will be able to show you a little bit better Okay, so here you can see that here it is more leaning into purple here and there is more, these stars are much brighter than on this one. And then here you can see that this is quite blue and here the detail is a little bit different. Here it is more navy blue, here it is definitely more purple. And the vibrancy of the colors again it is slightly different and these as I said are definitely more vibrant than than this one is even though you may not see it on camera that well so yeah so in my mind I would like Union Dragon to be more transparent when it comes to the the way they create their jigsaw puzzles because I understand that they may have put a different supplier so I don't know whether they will be selling out this one and remaining three remaining two sizes they will just sell what they have and then going forward all other jigsaw puzzles will look like the biggest butterfly and the whales or whether there will be this sort of inconsistency if you will in the range of the jigsaw puzzles that they have. Whether you like it or you don't like it, it's up to you to decide. In my mind, I would prefer to have the same product uh, across all the sizes rather than have this sort of inconsistency. And as I said, I would prefer Unidragon to be more transparent because the truth is that if you buy the royal size of these jigsaw puzzles, you will not get what you see on see in the videos that are on YouTube promoting this particular jigsaw puzzle. So yeah, that's that's pretty much all I wanted to share with you. I hope that you found that helpful and I want to wish you very Merry Christmas and lovely Happy New Year if you celebrate any of these and hope to see you here next time. Bye for now!